Hey everybody, Simmons Rogue here. I want to say, first of all, hello to all the new subscribers. I'm blown away. I'm blown away by how many people have subscribed over the last few days that I've been sick in bed. It was a very nice thing to see. And I'm hoping that you'll enjoy this gameplay of Persona 4 Golden that I'm going to start right now. I'll tell you what, the last few days I've been trying to figure out what I should play. I'm like, oh my gosh, there's so many people subscribing right now and I don't even have a game that I'm wanting to play right now. But a friend of mine asked me to play this. He bought it for me as well, so that's why I'm playing this. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. I've never played this Persona before, but I have played Persona 5 on the PS3 before. I played that and I streamed it on Twitch all the way through my 120-ish hours of gameplay I had on that game. And that, I didn't even, I didn't even scratch the surface of the content that game can provide. This intro though, wow. This is the most psychedelic looking intro I've ever seen from a video game. Shadow World, huh? All right, cool. Cool intro. Interesting. Let's get into the gameplay. Let's check config first. Uh, display. PC. Confirm. Looks good. Rendering all high because the game is really easy on the computer. Got subtitles on. I think. Voice line on. Where's subtitles at? Okay, they're on. I think we're good. That's all that matters. New game. Let's see what happens. You can connect to the internet to access new functions of Persona 4 Golden. Would you like to know more? Sure. The Vox Populi feature allows you to see what decisions other players have made at various points of the game. The rescue request function allows other players to help you when you're in a pinch, and you help others in turn. These features are not available at the very beginning of the game. They will be unlocked as the story progresses. Interesting. Difficulty level, huh? Difficulty does not affect the story. <clears throat> Alright, so here's the thing. I'm going to play this game one time through. I'm not going to play it again. So, given that is the case, we're going to have to go with it very hard. Uh, it says, do you hate yourself or are you supremely self-confident? This difficulty requires a strength of heart that never gives in. Ah, oh, that's me. That's me. <laughs> Change the difficulty later if you want. Relax and have fun with the game. Okay. Characters, art, and storylines depicted in this game are purely for work. Fan fiction, they some allude to persons living in the gutter, purely consequential. What's it doing? right into an anime sequence, huh? Okay, okay. Very slow moving car. Oh, a beauty. And an ugly. This is the same guy from Persona 5. Igor, I think his name is. Igor? Igor? Welcome to the Velvet Room. Well, thank you. Whoa. <laughs> ah, it seems we have a guest with an intriguing destiny. <laughs> Dude. You seriously look like you need some shut eye, man. Or some eye drops or something. My name is Igor. Mm. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. I feel like I met you before. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Oh. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. Okay. It may be 
that such a fate awaits you in the near future. I bet it does. Now then, why don't you introduce yourself? I am Sinless Rogue. Oh, last name first. Last name I see. That's me. Now, let's take a look into your future, shall we? Oh, you can do that, can you? Do you believe in fortune telling? Nope. Each reading is done with the same cards, yet the result is always different. <laughs> Life itself follows the same principles, doesn't it? Hmm. The tower in the upright position represents the immediate future. Okay. It seems a terrible catastrophe is imminent. What? The card indicating the future beyond that is... Sideways heart? The moon in Whoa. the upright position. It looks like a heart. This card represents a hesitation and mystery. Very interesting indeed. Why is it interesting? It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination, and a great mystery will be imposed upon you. In the coming days, you will enter into a contract of some sort, after which you will return here. Do I need a lawyer? The coming year is a turning point in your destiny. If the mystery goes unsolved, your future may be forever lost. Well, I better not have My that duty then. is to provide assistance to our guests wow. to ensure that does not happen. You're gonna help me, huh? Ah, I have neglected to introduce my assistant to you. Yeah, who's the beauty? This is Margaret. She is a resident of this place, like myself. She looks very ugly in this graphic setting, but she looks great in the anime setting. My name is Margaret. I am here to accompany you through your journey. Cool. We shall attend to the details another time. Until then, farewell. Farewell? Where am I going? Well, complimentary bathing suit fan service scene. Slim down this summer with the refreshing taste of calorie magic. And we're back. Now on to some juicy news. The Mayumi Yamano scandal. I'm sure everyone is... <laughs> yeah, first he bags a singer, then he has an affair with a TV announcer on the side. Do chicks really dig politicians? Isn't it just stuff like money and connections? When you get down to it, financial and political clout is what matters. Hey, what is that supposed to mean? Well, what do you think? That... That dialogue was a loss in translation right there. Last part well, of it I'm sure that you all know already, but at the end of this month, he will be transferring to another school. That's me. Quiet down, guys. I'm not done yet. I guess I thought I'd listen to me, but you Passengers headed for Inaba City and Yasuo Inaba Station. Please go to the other side of the platform.
involves the Enkistar Misuzu Hiragi preparing to tour overseas. Taro Namatame, a council secretary in the Inaba region, whom she married just last year, is now under suspicion of having an affair. What's more, his rumored mistress is the well-known TV oh, announcer. Of his should we go soon? Yeah, it's just about. The question on everyone's minds is how this love triangle will affect. <laughs> They nailed those Japanese names. That was something that Persona 5 did not do very well. That was scary. Flashback. Yasuo Inaba. Yasuo Inaba. Hmm. It's kind of weird to pause right there. Yeah, so Inaba should be. I don't think there should be a pause there. Yeah, so Inaba is how they probably should say it. Hey, over here. Hello, man. Who are you? Well, you're more handsome in person than in your photo. Are you hitting Welcome on me? Welcome to Inaba. I'm Ryotaro Dojima. I'll be looking after you. Oh. Let's see, I'm your mother's younger brother, and that about sums it up. Mm. It's been a long time, man. I'll say, you've really grown. I still remember when you were in diapers. This here's my daughter. Come on, Nanako. Introduce yourself to your cousin. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Haha. <laughs> what are you so shy for? Ow! <laughs> <laughs> well then, let's get going. My car's over there. That clunker. Hey. Unfriendly girl. <laughs> you dropped this. Unfriendly looking girl. She don't look she don't look unfriendly. Hey. Whatever. All I did was pick it up. Jeez. This is a note I made uh, with no good address. <clears throat> okay, bye. What's wrong? I got in the car and hit up the Jojima's house. Gas station. Inaba Central Shopping Center gas station. Hi, welcome to Mall. Geez, that was dangerous. Did you see him run in front of us while we were still moving? Can you go to the bathroom by yourself? Who's he? What? Uh -huh. Oh, he's talking to Nanako. Okay. <laughs> it's in the back to your left. You know which way is left? The side you don't hold your chopsticks in. Oh. Does that mean everybody in Japan uses chopsticks on their right? I know. Jeez. Whoa! Are you taking a trip? Did you see me get out of that car? <laughs> Both legs, same time. No, we just went to pick him up. He just moved here from the big city. A oh. city? Oops. Fill up my car while you're at it. Regular's fine. <clears throat> right away, sir. Good time as any for a smoke. <gasps> Smoking bad. Are you in high school? Aren't you supposed to be working? Does it surprise a city boy to see how little there is out here? Mm. There's so little to do, I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. You're really selling this town to me, man. Speaking of which... We're actually looking for part-time help right now. Oh. Nice segue. Give it some thought, why don't you? We don't mind if you're a student. Oh, I should get back to work. Monica's looking for me. Are you okay? I think that said she was looking at me, not for me. Did you get car sick? 
You don't look too good. Could it be exhaustion from the long trip? Now that you mentioned it, I feel a little dizzy. What's wrong? You okay? Uh, I just felt lightheaded, man. That's understandable. It must have been a long trip for you. Oh. Why not take a little walk? Get some fresh air. Just let me know when you're ready to go. I'll wait here. Why don't you take a walk and get some fresh air? The shopping district is near the house, so you should get to know where all the stores are. Help. Sam, the blue butterfly to save your progress. Okay. Hello, blue butterfly. Hey, it's a chick. Have we met before? I mean, just now. Mm, okay. Go oh, take it to herself. Okay. Alright, let's look around. Get out of here, birds. Okay. Dungeon, dungeon was waiting. Don't wander off. Okay. I like this shop. It's very nice. It's, con it's inconvenient and convenient at the same time. It's a delicate balance. This is what I expect country life to be like. Okay, you're weird. Fitting old capsule vending machines, dials are rusted in place. Variety of products, friendly looking old lady sits on the counter. Oh, what was that? What was that? No. Drinks are all sold out of the vending machine. Hey, do you know where my sack snack went? I had it in the fridge, but it's gone. Oh, I ate it just now. I thought it was a leftover. What? No, it wasn't leftovers. I'll make a trip to for later. Oh, really? Sorry about that. Well, I'm going to work, see ya. What? I was really looking forward to eating it. There seemed to be having a sibling dispute. I should leave them alone. Marukyu Sofa Shop. Old woman tending to it. Here's like a man, a single mindedly pounding on something in the back of the store. I decided not to enter. Hmm. We have something to do with the shopping district? It's a bit run down, but we have everything here. It used to be a lot more prosperous back in the day, but we only see regulars nowadays. If only Junas hadn't come into town. It's convenient, but it's a little sad. Oh. Sounds like a big store came in. And poster. The following books are being released on 420. 420! Just please! Uh, the Lovely Man, 2,200 yen. Famous Man series is all in stock. It's worth the study methods, 2,800 yen. Get an edge over your classmates. We get a mission, 1,600 yen. Now, you can be efficient too, and that's what it says. Okay. Get out of here, bird. Hey, dude. Dang, the next bus isn't going to come for a while. And if I miss one bus, and if you miss one bus, you're pretty screwed. If only I had a motorbike, I could go anywhere I wanted, any time I wanted. What how much they cost? Maybe I'll buy myself one. Okay. What was that? What was that? What was that? Something was waiting for me, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Uh, are you okay? She's worried about me. Ready to get back in the car? Yeah. During events, press back on the button to see the log and skip around to skip events out. I will never skip an event, but I may see the backlog. Dude, look at my house. It's legit. I've arrived. For the next year, this will be my home. All right, let's have a toast. Okay. A toast to my new home. So, your mom and dad are busy as always. They're working overseas, was it? I, I guess so. I know it's only for a year, but getting stuck in a place like this because of your parents? That's rough being a kid. I know. Well, it's just me and Nanako here, so it'll be nice having someone like you around. So long as you're here, you're part of the family. So make yourself at home. Cool. <laughs> Come on.
Come on, there's no need to be so formal. <laughs> Look, you're making Nanako all tense. Whoops. Well, anyway, let's eat. What? Oh, who's calling at this hour? Why is your phone on, man? Dojima speaking. Mm hmm. Yeah, I see. So where is it? Uh-huh. All right, I'm on my way. He's leaving. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. Sorry, but I gotta go take care of some business. Go ahead and eat without me. I don't know how late I'll be. Nanako, you help him out, okay? Okay. Nanako, it's raining out. What did you do with the laundry? I already brought it in. All right. Well, I'm off. Hmm, I wonder what he does. For this week. Next, let's take a look at the hourly breakdown of tomorrow's weather. With storm clouds moving in from the west, Expect rain throughout the day tomorrow in most areas. Let's eat. Sure. I find myself alone with Nanako. Might want to strike up a conversation. Must be tough. I don't know what that means, so I won't It's do always that. like this. Oh, it must be tough having him leave. My dad's a detective. Oh. Now for the local news. City Council Secretary Taro Namatame is under fire for an alleged relationship with a female reporter. <gasps> His wife, Enka Ballad sensation Misuzu Hiragi, revealed to this station that she will likely pursue damages. In response, iTelevision has decided to cancel all of announcer Mayumi Yamano's televised appearances. This is just a guess, but I think I television should be spelled A I instead of E Y E. Seems kind of weird for a Japanese television station to be called I like that. Until allegations of an affair with Mr. Namatame are resolved, she'll remain off the air and out of the public eye. This is boring. Tell me about it. At Juness. Every day is Customer Appreciation Day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day is great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. Wow. Aren't you going to eat? What a singing voice the kid has. <laughs> oh, you can save the game by using the calendar in the living room. This, this calendar? Hey. Alright, let's see what's going on. Quiz shows on TV. Not it goes at a loss. I should leave her alone, I guess. Okay. What do we got in here? Because it isn't used very often, the kitchen is organized, but there are ingredients are or in the fridge you might be able to make lunch. Okay. Is there ingredients in the fridge? There's some fried rice. You want to eat it? Alright. Has no taste at all. Strange. What was the point of that? Can I do it again? Nothing catches my eye. Okay. Tired from a long trip, I shouldn't be wandering outside. Okay. Something tells me I should be going to bed now. I didn't see anything else around to interact with. That sounded like it was right behind me. This is the room I'm borrowing from Dojima. Let me see. What's this? I'm tired. I should rest. Tired. I should rest. Go to sleep. No. Tired, tired. Why can't I? Why you, why you do this to me, game? This says the same thing. Guess we gotta sleep, man. So how it goes. 
And since we're sleeping, I'm going to end the episode right there. Why? Because I got a lot of people that want me to play long term content for like an hour or two hours, and I got other people that want it short. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to record four short episodes and upload them all at the same time. And we'll see how that goes over, you know? So, uh, click the box in the upper right corner of the screen to go to the next episode. Or just clink, clink, click the link in the description instead.